Susie, good evening. Both parties in this story describe this as a scary situation for them. On one hand, you have this YouTuber who was shot in the leg and had to be rushed to the hospital, understandably concerning. And on the other hand, you have staff and teachers inside of the school who say they have no idea why someone was outside recording them. Oh! Shot me! A tense confrontation outside a synagogue and Hebrew girls' school ended in a shooting Thursday. Stay there. Just stay there. A YouTube curator who goes by Furry Potato was live streaming outside the Etz Jacobs Synagogue in the Fairfax district. The person recording, who goes by Zoe, says she is part of the First Amendment auditors community on YouTube. They're users who record videos in public. They say to exercise their First Amendment rights. Listen, nobody should freak out when someone's recording from a public sidewalk. And that's all she was doing. But the school principal said the whole thing worried her and the students. An individual was filming our girls at the school and the building, the perimeter of the building extensively, including all the windows and the exits. And this caused a great deal of anxiety to both our staff and our students. And during the incident, we did try, try to keep the girls calm and the building was placed on lockdown. A man who says he saw what happened said he also was concerned. So I asked her several times, I said, you know, what are you, what are you doing? Why are you taking pictures of like right in the door where all these young girls are? And like, it's, it's a synagogue, like, you know, and they, they would not respond and just came, got very kind of close and far. And it was just, it was, it was bizarre behavior. The video shows the security guard's gun going off and Zoe shouting. Shot me in the leg. Zoe said it was then that a bullet grazed her leg. She was taken to the hospital and treated. You know, I'm just taking shots of the thing. You know, he comes up super aggressive. I'm not looking to talk to that guy at that point. Police say she did not commit a crime. And again tonight, we have just learned breaking news that security guard has been arrested and charged with assault with a deadly weapon. Reporting live from the Fairfax District, Sarah Donchi, KCAL 9 News. All right, Sarah.